Good morning. Happy Sunday. It's nice to see you again. It's time for 10 big minutes at 10 o'clock. Today's original air date is September 19th, 2021. Uh, today we are talking about building strength from the inside out. During this time of chaos right now, um, a lot of people are really upset a lot of chaos, a lot of division going on, and that means a lot of destruction, even if it's uh, friendships that you have, uh, relationships, um, things that you thought were solid, you know, a couple of bad words, and boom, you know, things, it's very destructive. So what we want to do is get away from that, and we're going to be talking about that today. First, I'm going to read you a card from Postcards from Spirit by Colette Baron reed Okay, dearest you, did you know that when you stop fighting and accept everything exactly as it is now, everything exactly as it is now, miracles start to happen? There is a freedom in this kind of radical acceptance. Let go of unrealistic expectations and see things as they really are, not how you'd like them to be. You'll be surprised how everything seems to fall into place. When you refuse to accept things, life gets messy, you act messy, and your world stays in chaos, tension, and disarray. But don't try to force a change or manipulate circumstances. Instead, learn about what is in front of you and face it with your eyes fully open. Then you can decide stay or go, sit or stand, sink or swim, move or stay still. Acceptance is the key to freedom and opens the door to the real opportunities waiting to be discovered. Set yourself and others free. Okay. During this time, I see so many people worrying about what's going on and this person did this and that corporation did that and now they want us to do this and everything that's going on um, and it feels very chaotic. But I want you, my friends, to learn to be strong and okay regardless of what's going on. Okay, because what happens is when we get engaged in conversations uh, about what this, you know, politician did, what, um, you know, this person said, what's happening in this country, what's happening in that country, truth of the matter is, it's always been this way. There's a few upgraded things, but the thing is, it's always been this way, but we didn't know it because all we had was TV and newspaper. But the, hey Tim, good morning. But the things that we see going on in the government, other governments, and people are like, oh my God, can you believe this? You know what? Oh my God, it's been that way our whole lives. We just didn't know it. So what does that mean? We survived it before, we will survive it again. The only difference is we have awareness now. We, we will get through this. How you get through this is up to you. And I want to give you some tools today to get through this as cleanly and as strongly as you can so that you are a stronger person, the tree that cannot be moved in regardless of the biggest storm. Okay. So what happens is we get right now into a if then scenario. If this went away, then everything would be okay. If this person went away, then everything would be okay. You know, um, if this person, if I could just convince this person of how I feel, then everything would be okay. Um, when this person does what I expect them to do, then everything will be okay. 
And the problem with that is you are giving your power away. Your sense of okayness is now not within you. You give the power to exterior things, people, that you have no control of. You're giving that power away to be okay. It's all dependent on other people. If other people like me, if I can convince them that they're wrong. No, no, please don't do that because you are, your sense of okayness is now dependent on other things, whatever. And what I want you to, to focus on is being okay regardless. Being okay regardless. If people don't get you, if they don't like you, if they don't accept you, if they don't understand you, it's time to tribe up. It's not because something was wrong with you. It was because people didn't value you the way that you were. And there's no true love in that. Okay? So cut any ties to if, if this happens, when this happens, I'll be okay. When that changes, I'll be okay. Cut all ties with that because you're holding yourself up from feeling okay now. And that's not good. Who knows how long our current situation will last. Do you want to live like that? I don't. I don't. Okay. How can we be okay in times like this? One thing to always remember, God is still in charge. If you call him God, your higher power, source, spirit, whatever works for you, the ultimate being, the creator of everything, is still in charge, okay? And that's what, that's what you hang on to, knowing that, having a better relationship with him so that you've got a, you've got a, a rope, a lifeline to hang on to. Help me, God, get through this situation. I, you know, take away this feeling from me. Help me get rid of this bad feelings I have because I got in a fight with somebody over politics and we don't disagree and we're not friends anymore. But it's extremely destructive. You need to be okay regardless of what people say and what people do. Learn to be okay. Focus on how to be more joyful, happy, and turn the rest over to God. You know, know where your power ends and God begins. And you're going to find out your power ends pretty quickly, doesn't it? So what else are you going to do? Turn it over to God and give it over to him and give the worry over to him and have the peace of mind knowing that he has your back. Your job is in how you control your mind, what you let in, and how you process it. Okay? We don't want to go down a negative road. You want to surround yourself with people who support you. Okay? People who love you, even if you disagree. Even if you disagree. People that still will love you. That's real love. How many people have you seen lost friends on on uh, on Facebook because of uh, political differences? That wasn't real love, was it? That's not what you want. That's not what you want. See, united. Hey, Anna. Good morning. United doesn't. United means we all have the same goal. Okay. United means we all have the same goal. It does not mean being in lockstep at all times and we agree on how it gets done. For example, we all want a better country. We all have different opinions on how it's done, right? But try to remember, we're still united in our main goal, okay? Yeah. Um, be united in this, the same goal, even if you don't, uh, disagree on everything or you're, you know, you're on the different side of the fence, you know, um, because people will always have a different perspective. We're all individuals. We're all wired completely differently. What makes 
us expect them to do and think everything that we think. Let go of that. Let go of that and keep your sense of okayness. I'm okay even if they disagree. We are still friends even if they disagree. Now, if that person walks away, okay, they just made it easier for you because you want to tribe up and have a strong network of friends around you to support you where you are, as you are, that loves and accepts you, okay? Surrender to the idea of, I win when they see things my way. I win. I prove them wrong. I knew it. I knew it. I knew they'd see it my way. <clears throat> no, 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 no. There's no strength in that. There's no victory in that. The best thing to do is to focus on you and being okay, regardless of what's going on, knowing that there's nothing new under the sun. These types of things have happened before. We will get through it, but be okay where you are, as you are, and please, please do not leave your sense of okayness out there blowing in the wind. You know, if they, if they approve, I'm okay. If they like me, I'm okay. If they agree with me, I'm okay. No, 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 no. Learn to be okay within yourself, within yourself. So that just like a tree in a storm, it doesn't phase you. It doesn't blindside you. It doesn't topple you over because you have so much inner strength. You know you're okay. You know that God has your back. You know that you have everything that you need. And what you don't have will come to you when the time is right. But in the meantime, please, my friends, Learn to be okay, regardless of what's going on. Don't get caught up into, did you hear this latest thing? Did you hear, oh my, oh my God, now they're doing. Let it pass you, just like a leaf going down a, a, a creek. Just let it pass you. Okay, yeah. I don't have to, I don't have to jump into that. I, I'm not going to dirty myself with that. And focus on yourself and building your own, hey Cody, building your own inner strength so that you can face any situation, any time, and be a better you. You'll be much happier, much stronger, and you will feel much more settled knowing that it's all gonna be okay, that it's all gonna be okay. You have built a strong you. I am sending you so much love today. And if there's anything I can do, I am so here for you. If, if you didn't understand something, if you want to know how can I do this, how can I be okay when this is going on or that's going on, or contact me. Send me a private message. I am here for you. I will help you get through this, okay? I'm your wing girl. I will help you get through this. Um, and uh, it's going to be all good. It's going to be all good. Just remember where your strength comes from. If you're going to pick teams, pick the one who's in control, right? All right. Take care. I'm sending you so much love, and I'll see you next time.